Good morning, Stallions. Today is Wednesday, November 8th. Happy birthday to Taryn Rowland. If you see him today, be sure to wish him a happy birthday. Our lunch today is mini corn dogs or sub sandwich, carrots and celery with ranch, ice cream, and apple slices. Tomorrow's breakfast will be yogurt parfait, and lunch will be spaghetti with chicken alfredo. Our weather forecast is cloudy with a high of 55 and a low of 34 degrees. Today's important announcements are it's Wellness Wednesday with our days getting shorter and the weather getting colder. It is becoming more difficult to get outside to exercise and play. However, it is important to remember all school age children should get 60 minutes of exercise and play a day. What are some fun ways you can exercise indoors? Can you exercise what you've learned on Wellness Wednesday to get exercise indoors? I have an idea. Let's all try performing different exercises during commercial breaks when you're watching TV with your family. Can you use the exercises you know to create an exercise plan for you and your family to do during commercial breaks? For example, every commercial do 10 push-ups, 10 sit-ups, or 10 burpees, or do plank holds for one minute. This week's exercise is a side plank. Lie on your side with your legs straight. Prop yourself up with your forearm so your body forms a diagonal line. Rest your other hand on your hip. Keep your stomach muscles tight while you hold your body off the ground. Who can hold this for 60 seconds without falling? Our leadership quote of the week is, Be strong. You never know who you are inspiring. Interesting fact of the day is, did you know Americans eat 46 million turkeys each Thanksgiving? <clears throat> Our joke of the day is, what did the vampire say to the turkey? Happy Thanksgiving. Stay tuned after the pledge for a book talk from Miss Humphrey. It is now time for the pledge. Attention, salute, pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Have a great day. Hey, Southern Oaks kiddos. I'm going to start every Wednesday doing a book talk recommended by a student in our school. So if you have recommendations, you can send them to the front office. I won't be able to read every book that's recommended, but I will choose one or two to read and try to do a book talk at least every other week, if not every week. My first book talk is on the book Stand Tall, Molly Lou Mellon. This was a book that Cy si Hayden recommended through the pumpkin contest. He told me it was a great book and that's why he chose to do his pumpkin character on Molly Lou Mellon. So I read it and he was right. It is a great book. And it's a great book because it talks about the importance of loving yourself and being you and knowing that who you are makes you special and there's no one else like you. Um, and that's exactly what happened with Molly Lou Mellon. Molly Lou was a little, a little different. Like right here, you can see, she can stack pennies on her teeth, but her grandma told her, that's okay. That's what makes you you, and you just keep doing that um, and because no one else can do that. And she found out when she went to a new school that at first, kids made fun of her teeth, but then when they saw what she could do with her teeth, they were amazed and they thought it was cool. And so they no longer made fun of her, uh, and she didn't, she didn't let it bother her when they said that she had big teeth. She just did what she did with her big teeth and everyone thought well that's pretty cool and that's what makes you special so it's a great book to read anybody can read it I'm 47 years old I love the book so it doesn't matter how old you are or how young you are it's a great book to read and if you have another great book that you want me to read and do a book talk on just send send your list to the front office I'll choose a book to read and we'll do another book talk. I look forward to sharing your love of books with you, and I look forward to um, reading some books I haven't read before. I also want to say congratulations to the choir. I could kind of hear you over the intercom, or over the, um, through my office this morning, and you all sounded great. And for, if you're in the principal pot, we're gonna eat lunch together on Friday at noon. Principal pot, lunch Friday at noon. Have a great day, Southern Oaks.